Well, hello, glorious people of the interwebs, and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Today, we're checking out something interesting I found while exploring the East Grizzlies, and I figured we would explore it together. So I just happened upon this, and I was like, you know what? I've never really yep. checked out what this little building was up here, and it looks pretty interesting. So I hope you guys all enjoy this episode. We don't know what's going to happen in here. But I have a feeling it's going to be pretty interesting. So we're going to this point just north of the Grizzlies East. And just above the end on the map, there will be a little square here. Now the way we get up to this is by just going up this little hill here. And we're going to find this creepy little shack nestled into the woods up here. I didn't even see it at first when I got up here. I was like, maybe it's just another one of those burned down buildings that shows up as a, you know, a little square on the map. But lo and behold... Uh, we got some interesting stuff. The horse... Okay, there's there's a snake. I was like, the horse does not want to go near it. But no, in fact, that was a snake. All right, calm down, horsey. Please don't leave me. Yeah, you just you just chill right there. Snake's not going to get you, bud. I got bit by a snake for the first time earlier, and I was not pleased about it. But thank you all for your continued support on the Red Dead Redemption 2 series. You all are truly amazing, and I cannot say thank you enough. So... This is an interesting little hut we got here. It is particularly creepy looking. So, we got some weird pillows. But it's like the... It's a like a really cheaply put together house. But it looks kind of like things have been maybe set... Oh, wow. Oh, that's a human body with chains all around. Oh, there's two human bodies. Oh, no. Okay, so humans have died here. <gasps> there's a creepy ass bird. Bird, what the hell are you doing here? It's a western raven. Perfect. I've never seen... It's just chilling in here. That's... That's weird. What do we got over here? Do we have any books or anything? Assorted salted offal? Offal? Looks like herbivore bait. Is there some weird music in here? And we got something like brewing here. I'm pretty sure this is the witch's hut. I'm full on herbivore bait. And we can drink this mysterious liquid. I don't know if I should. Is there anything else that's collectible around here? Oh, we've got all sorts of tonics here. Can I pick up the tonic? Oh, but what kind of meat is all around us? we got moonshine here. It definitely seems like somebody probably still lives here as well. we got snake oil. What else we got? Oh, okay. Let's drink the mysterious liquid. Why not, right? What's the worst that could happen? Are we going to get superpowers? Oh, oh. Oh. Why did we just get left in the woods? What happened? Did we gain any... We have all of our money. Do we have superpowers? Our beer... We're clothed? Where are we? I think we're right next to it again. I wonder what happens when we go back. What does the... What does the liquid do? Okay. Well, there's a chest here as well. I completely forgot about that. I don't know what that was all about. That was weird. So we got a hair tonic and Kentucky bourbon in here. Interesting. So that was really, really strange. I wonder what happens if I shoot the... Can I drink it again? I can't drink it again. That was particularly strange. I decided to come... Oh, are there freaking wolves here now? I was going to say, I decided to come back at night. See if anything had changed here. And there's a bunch of wolves spawned here now. Calm down, horse. Everything's fine. Woo! Anybody else want to go? Good horse. If that was an Arabian, I'd be bucked off to kingdom come already. Uh, 
Did it run away? I think it did. I don't know if it's going to come back, though. Well, if there was somebody here... They're probably not hanging out. Is that Raven still here? It is. So I don't think anything's changed other than obviously the creepy freaking Raven. Although this stuff restocks itself. They definitely picked up a lot of this. And it all just respawns. Interesting. Can I drink this again? Now that it's nighttime? Nope, sure can't. Huh. I was really hoping there would be like a witch here at night. I gotta see if this... This crow or raven or whatever the hell it is has something to do with this area. Well, what's the worst that can happen if we shoot this bird? Guess we're gonna find out. Come on, we can pick it up. Pick up a raven. Oh, we had an option to cook it. There we go. Oh, that was a weird screen glitch right there. What the hell was that all about? So we're kick we're cooking the the witch's bird. I wonder if we're gonna die, maybe. I don't think anything's gonna happen. <laughs> we had to try. So two things. I decided to go back down to Butcher's Creek and check out the building with this satanic uh, pentagram under it. Because I'm thinking maybe the witch's cauldron is tied to that. Because we still haven't figured out exactly what this does. And then I realized I've got this subquest here, which I didn't have before, which is do not seek absolution. Which means somehow my honor increased. So I'm thinking perhaps that may have somehow increased my honor, even though I didn't see it and... I don't know, who knows? Maybe it gives you a little bit of honor so it is pretty good to drink? I'm not sure. But we're going down to the satanic symbols and we'll see if anything happens down there. You know, it's really creepy. Just sitting on top of a known satanic symbol pentagram thing. Just eerily sounding. So this activates at like 4 o'clock at night. And um, I'm a little worried. I guess we'll see what happens. All right. It's almost four. Maybe we need to be super dishonorable as well. I didn't even think about that. 356. Oh, there it is. Nothing has happened. Interesting. This has to do something. I wonder if there are more of these around. So, where's a goat? I just heard one. Okay, we need to kill this thing very quietly. And without anybody seeing... I think we're good. Oh, no, don't go into the open. Oh, there's a guy right there. Yeah. Oh, no, what did I do that for? Major issue. Crap. Pick up the goat and run. Oh. I'm just trying to steal a goat. Don't mind me. Maybe we have to take one of the hillbillies in there. Oh, you need to run with this goat faster there, home skillet. Why would they? I can't believe I drew on them and shot. Maybe the whole key is being chased by all these and we turn into some kind of demon lord and murder them all. Give them a good old cleansing. So this doesn't seem to work. Goat is not the key to the pentagram. <laughs> oh, but oh my god, there's so many hillbillies. They're just coming after me. Stupid hillbillies, no! Oh my god. Oh, we hit on the wrong side of the tree. What a huge disaster. Okay. What? I'm out of- what? I'm not out of ammo. What the crap is going on here? Oh my god. It's the hillbilly apocalypse. They're everywhere. <laughs> oh, whoa. Freaking 
Woods hillbillies. I don't know what I'm shooting at. It is super late at night. Maybe we just need to massacre, massacre the entire town, put all of their bodies on the pentagram and see what happens. So let's spend a little bit of time murdering everybody here and see what happens. So I can't for the life of me figure out what the hell that potion did. I mean, I haven't coughed since drinking it, but I don't think that has anything really to do with it. I mean, because typically, well, let's try it. I don't want to really give any spoilers away. Oh, the frickin' bird is back. Oh, well, no, okay. That bird is invincible. Yeah, you just, you, you know what? I can't figure out what this is, but there's got to be something larger to do with it. But you can only drink it once. And I'm wondering if you need to drink it at like the perfect time or or whenever is supposed to happen, or maybe something extra will happen if you drink it at the right time. I'm not 100% sure, but since you can only drink it once, there's no way really for me to tell. So I'm really curious to see if anybody else has experienced anything different. We can't burn anything in here. Nothing really happens from doing this. I'm just curious if we could just burn this thing to the ground and if maybe witches would show up or something. But that's not working. I have no idea what that what that did. Obviously, it put us to sleep, but maybe it was just to kind of screw with us. Or maybe she, like, stole a kidney or, you know, I don't know, took some bone marrow or something. Oh, jeez, that was a nice explosion. At least we blew up all the freaking bones. <laughs> Interesting. And this thing is just still going. I wonder if we, like, uncovered anything secret in here. Nope, so everything is still... The bird is just like, deuces, bro! Some... Oh, it's just like a little light there. I was like, there's something interesting there now. So yeah, I don't know. This is a pretty interesting little Easter egg. But quite frankly, I can't for the life of me figure out what it's supposed to do. I perused everywhere on the internet after that happened. and was, There's nothing about it. Nobody's able to figure out what happens after you drink from that cauldron. So maybe we can figure it out together as a community to see if we could solve this little mystery. I'm probably gonna go around and go to the vampire and maybe the devil, you know, the the hermit cave. So I have to start there a new save go. and go back to them and see if maybe drinking the potion before interacting with them, if weird things happen. I have no idea, but we're gonna find out. Thank you all for watching. Just a little bit of a shorter episode today, checking out the witcher's, witch's cauldron. I hope you all enjoyed it. Stupid rabbit, now you're dead. That's why you stay out of the road. But thank you all for your continued support on the series so far. And if you don't know, I live stream at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So feel free to join in for those live streams. I can't wait for Red Dead Redemption 2 online. I will see you all in the next one.